friends, how you doing today? I am doing well. I hope you are also. And I have some pickups. I got some pickups, some stuff that came in the mail, some stuff that I ordered and it got delivered throughout the course of the week. And I want to share my stories with you because movies are memories and that's what I do. And you can comment below. We talk back and forth, have a little conversation because that's what I like to do. And we'll keep this thing flowing as I show you what I picked up. Uh, first title I got is a copy of free guy this is the blu-ray digital copy and um as always at the end of this video what i will do is i will if the if the digital copy is in here and i will check and see if the digital copy is in here i will give you the digital copy for free guy right free guy because i don't do anything with the digital copies now i saw this movie in the drive-in um recently i'd say within the last month or so a couple months ago a couple months couple, within the last couple months i saw this movie along with that jungle jungle cruise movie with the the rock i really enjoyed it i really thought it was good it had it had a um it had a longevity feel does that make sense to you? like 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 almost like a, a a movie that 10 years from now i would probably put in and i'd be like okay i can still i can still go with this i can still watch this i still get it I still enjoy it and it's all still good um big ryan reynolds fan so i had to hop all over this so free guy if you don't know what free guy is it's about this this program this this video game created character um and these users kind of like a tron type setup uh playing the game or whatever but then you have like the regular characters that you see in video games that are just kind of like just walking around you know like if you were playing like a grand theft auto it would just be like the walking around characters well the free guy played by ryan reynolds is one of these walk around characters but then one day he just realizes that he's he's like the real deal he can do what he wants to do he doesn't have to he doesn't have to uh stay a program he doesn't have to keep doing the same thing every day he could actually switch it up and, and become somebody and i thought this was a really good movie so free guy my first pickup um next one came in the mail on a sunday i love i love when i love when it come in the mail on a sunday when it, this was an amazon order amazon delivers on a sunday yes when you think that your mail is done Amazon comes through with you on a Sunday. <sighs> what a concept. Joy. Anyway, um, I have this on DVD. This was an upgrade. A copy of Casual Sex starring, um, let me see if I can get the names here right, Leah Thompson and Victoria Jackson. Uh, Victoria Jackson coming from Saturday Night Live. Leah Thompson coming from Some Kind of Wonderful, Back to the Future. Um, big fan. Um I have not seen this movie for years. I mean, I have it on DVD, but I have not watched it. And if I remember correctly, and, and tell me if I am wrong, I think a young Andrew Dice Clay plays one of the dates that I think Victoria Jackson or Leah Thompson goes on as a young uh, Andrew Dice Clay. And I, I I can't get enough of some Andrew Dice Clay, young, old, whatever. Um, it's, it's one of those... What company is this? It's a Mill Creek. Is this a Mill Creek? It's a Mill Creek. And you know Mill Creek does these old VHS cover look look at things there but when you slide it open you get the original cover art which i think is kind of cool and uh let me put a uh, free guy because at the end of this video please do me a favor hit that like button and that subscribe button at the end of this video i'm going to give you that digital code um next pickup i have here and this was because if you watched one of my other videos you saw that me and my son kind of went at it because he was upset that i bought the 4k of howie the duck but I did not buy the 4K of the original Space Jam. So I went out and I bought the 4K of the original Space Jam. Now, the problem with that was, is the new Space Jam was coming out. Now, am I going to buy the Blu-ray now that I have the 4K? Or am I going to buy the 4K? Because I need the 4K and the Blu-ray to go with the 4K and the Blu-ray that I got for the... Yeah, this this is a battle. This is this is a thing. Um, it's the Space Jam, A New Legacy. Um, I did watch this. It's not sealed. Is the digital copy in there? If it is, it's yours. If it's not in there, then I'm sorry. Oh, not in there. There we go. No digital copy. I bought it without the digital copy. I bought it used off of eBay. Um, I did pay $12 for it. I figured $12 for a 4K Blu-ray combo pack is worth it. I'm pretty sure I paid more for the first Space Jam. I did see this with him. It was okay. I prefer the first one. I prefer the Michael Jordan over... Who's this guy? I'm not, I'm not a sports guy. I'm sorry. Please, please do not beat me up and kill me for... For who this uh, who who's it, who is this guy? Le, 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 oh, LeBron James. I'm sorry, LeBron James. I'm not I'm not a I'm not a basketball guy, so I don't I'm not familiar. I do know Michael Jordan. I think everybody knows Michael Jordan, but LeBron James. Maybe I, maybe he's the guy. Maybe I should know who that is, but unfortunately, whatever. Um, his acting was rough. 
I mean, I've watched it. Michael Jordan was actually pretty good in this first, first Space Jam. I don't get me. I mean, if I'm wrong, whatever. But um, I thought he was good in the first Space Jam. I thought the first story with the first Space Jam was cool. I thought uh, the cameos of all the different Looney Tunes characters were really cool. But this one, I don't know. For some reason, I, I felt like it dragged a little bit. I felt like by the time I got to the big game at the end, I was kind of like, I don't care. I don't care if you win or lose. I don't care anymore. Um, and LeBron James' acting was... He's no Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan probably... He could probably could have been a good actor if he would have just kept on acting. I don't know. This, he was pretty good. I mean, I don't know. This guy. Eh. Um, so Space Jam, a new legacy. No digital code, though. I'm sorry. No digital code. Um, and my last pickup here is another um, another Scream Factory title. And I've never seen it. I've never seen it. But I had to pick it up because it was Scream Factory. I had to pick it up because it was a new release. And I have to pick it up because for some reason somebody was selling it on eBay for like 15 bucks, And I was like, I should grab it now before the price starts going up or it goes out of print. Then I'm going to be in trouble. And it, it sounded interesting. Um, a movie called, this is Wes Craven's, which got to be got to be a winner right there, Deadly Friend. Um, a Breakfast Club version of The Bride of Frankenstein. 2K scan, new interviews with Christy Swanson. I know who Christy Swanson is. Um, hmm. When I did the reading on it, what I got from it was something to do with some kind of robot, and then it turns into like a killer robot. I, I don't know. I, I mean, uh, let's see here. From director Wes Craven, I mean, it comes a, a terrifying tale of technology gone haywire. Lonely teenager genius uh, Paul, Matthew Labatou from... Uh, Barbarians at the Gate. That must have been a big hit. Barbarians at the Gate. Uh, a specialist in brain research has two best friends. His remarkable robot and his beautiful girl next door. Kirsty Swanson, Buffy the Vampire Slayer, the original one. Not the TV series. Uh, when a tragedy strikes both of his friends, he d desperately tries to save them by pushing technology beyond its known limits into a terrifying new realm. Like a modern day Dr. Frankenstein, Paul discovers too late that he has created a rampaging monster so i'm assuming the girlfriend dies he puts some kind of digital stuff into the girlfriend turns into some kind of robot killing girlfriend that's my guess on that one ding 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 what do we have for her, johnny um collector's edition scream factory um i did get this used let's see what the condition is does have the all alternative cover art inside here and we do have the disc which the disc is in good condition and we're looking good here that's everything's everything everything's looking good so deadly friend now available from scream factory uh and as promised i will crack open free guy here and see if you can get a copy of free guy for free wow isn't that ironic all right so, Free Guy, the year's funniest film, includes not good but great bonus features. Not good but great bonus features. And we do have a digital code. Are we ready? Redeem your digital code download. Here you go. And I will hold that still. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And with that said, my friends, please do me a favor. Please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. And I will see you.